Today we're going to learn all about being vegan from our resident vegan YouTube experts. Check this out. This is it. This is the beans on the toast. If you want to hit the big time, do drama videos. Look at this. Dear vegans, shut up! I hate you! Jeff wonders if the vegan couple are uneducated. Jeff can't spell the word comment. They may look the same, but one's different. Bacon though! Never heard that before. No vegans were harmed in the making of this commercial or something like that. But... Um, do you guys have any uh, animal products in your sauce? Now a vegan pregnancy channel. Okay. Uh oh no! I'm gonna get this 12 pack of chicken, ramen noodle soup, get a couple of them, and I'm gonna throw the packets out. So guess what? It's fucking vegan. You're an idiot. Everything I did was for more likes, more views, more followers. I will feel valued. I will feel happiness. And they'd be like cha-ching. You will never get rid of me unless you kill me. Okay. He's... He's a killer. He's a murderer. Oh, this fucking sucks. Cows are basically horses, the holocaust of the animals. Billions and billions are killed every year just in the U.S. alone. The color of your skin don't matter to me. Justice, compassion, veganism, and meat is murder were chanted repeatedly. 10,000 people turned up on that day. It's massive. It's going to snowball. What did she say? God bless you. God bless you. Oh, Thank you. Right. Um, that's when you, that's when you, I remember, like, huh? when you first watched it and realised. I kind of like to be the president to show you how
There's clearly like they, you know, there's there's like there's like we could we would get along. I'm pretty sure of this. Eating mangoes is like having saxophones playing in your ears when you're eating mangoes. You know it's like making love. This is our blue planet. Here we have Europe, including Denmark, and interconnected to them, the Faroe Islands. A pseudo-independent country with relative autonomy. But remaining within the Kingdom of Denmark for some central aspects as police, judicial system, military defense, and foreign affairs. Nevertheless, they're breaking European law on these islands with what is called the Grint. A tradition that involves stranding complete pods of pilot whales and dolphins. On these killing beaches, around 1,000 pilot whales are slaughtered each year. Populations could face a reduction of 30% over three generations. All in the name of tradition. She's an alpha with omegas and she's down to play. If she's not soft, then I won't eat her cause she's worth the way. Fur? Is that real fur? Yeah, yeah. Yeah? I hate animals too. Yeah? Yeah, I hate them. I like to watch them being skinned alive for a jacket. It's nice. She's filled with candy juices that drip down every bite And mixed with ice is nice, I've done it twice in the same night When I talk about eating healthy, eating plant-based, one of the first things people say to me is I'd love to do that, but it's just too expensive. And that's because there is this idea, this powerful entrenched idea that healthy eating, the vegan lifestyle, is something that is reserved for the well-heeled elite only. But is this really true? Well, to find out, my son Trapper and I decided to hit up some markets around town and see what we could get. You ready to make a video? You guys filming? Yeah, is that all right? No? No, you, can't, right. you can't film it. Either. Okay, sorry. And the grand total for this outing, $24 for two juices. Next stop, Whole Foods. One bag of goji berries. Delicious dried fruit, but nonetheless, dried fruit. For this outing was $26.99. So that was kind of a failure. We went over our budget. At this point, you must be thinking, man, I'm gonna have to be making some serious bank in order to be vegan. Next up. Trapper, have you ever been in Viarta? Can't say I have. Um, sorry about that. You Don't get me wrong. Oh, uh, no, no, no problem. <laughs> we got shut down. Are you kidding me? Grand total at Viarta, $23.68. If you missed it, it goes like this. The idea that eating plant-based is just too expensive, that's just contempt prior to first-hand investigation. It's just lazy. If you do it right and you do it smart, I think you'll be really surprised. So don't buy into the hype. And oh, she's so exotic, she's found around the world. She's not your average local supermarket kind of girl. Talking about strong women, our Norwich correspondent Banana Warrior Princess is with us this evening. Banana. Oh, 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 sorry, Chris. Sorry, Chris, I couldn't hear you. I was eating some mango. Um, right, I'm in Norwich today reporting for Plant Based News. Do you think we, we should still um, raise animals for food then and eat them? Yeah, I love chicken. <laughs> you love chicken? It might it's actually like... be better for our health if like, we all turned vegetarian, I read. We might like live longer, but... That's cool. Some in interesting uh, initial thoughts there. What is your um, initial reaction to... Or what do you think the meaning of sentience means to you, to you guys? Uh, it's basically mercy, treating all creatures with, uh, with respect. It's, yeah. 
offering them rights and taking into consideration the uh, consequences that they get. I wouldn't go vegan though. <laughs> Sorry. <Yeah. laughs> I do believe in meat protein. I don't think I can get the same amount of protein from nuts or what. How much? How much protein do you need? Can I ask? Loads. Mm-hmm. How much? <laughs> Are we bulking? <laughs> I mean, there's a bodybuilder right here. He's vegan. Um, do you think he gets enough protein? Oh. But he obviously does. <laughs> he obviously does get the gains. Um, I, I don't think I could adapt that to my lifestyle. I genuinely don't. Yeah. And one passing question. If you had the choice between killing animals, killing human beings, or not killing either, which would you do? The way you phrase that is very tricky. Yeah, again. <laughs> I, can, I can tell you I'm not going to kill either, but I'm probably going to have chicken for dinner. Okay, not killing either, that's be, uh, veganism. I'm probably going to have chicken for dinner, sorry. <laughs> you prioritise taste over life. <laughs> yeah. yeah. If, if you, you, if you, no, if you want to phrase it that way, I don't think it's fair. But if you're going to phrase it that way, yeah, sure. So there you have it, Chris. Some interesting reactions there. It's back to you in the studio. But if she's out of season, that's when you just might see To get your mango fix, you'll find yourself down on your knees You know, it's getting really crazy in the vegan YouTube community So recently, there has been a lot of drama on YouTube And there are vegans bashing other vegans Everybody bashing freely the banana girl nowadays Um those get upset girls, just everybody, just so many vegans attacking other vegans. And I don't get it. It's just incredibly counterproductive. It doesn't make any sense to me why we are wasting our time and our energy um, focusing on drama, but like on another vegan. <laughs> like what the hell guys? We vegans are 1% of the population. So that is a very, very, very tiny amount of people in this world that are vegan. We're all fighting for the same cause. We are all on the same team. (laughs) If anything, it's just dividing everybody. You know, the meat, dairy, and eggs industry are all laughing at us right now. (laughs) And they're going to be like, whoa, this is a walk in the park for us. This is exactly what they want. They're all laughing at us right now. We just look like complete morons you know the animals are probably sitting there being like what the fuck guys i think we should be redirecting our focus on to veganism again like let's inform people people are not getting educated at all by this video saying oh he should he said this she said that i never said this he's lying like what guys come on it's about veganism let's get back to the core message i don't have a core message if you don't have a core message that's making a positive impact on the planet what the, what, 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 what the fuck are you doing what is it for seriously why not influence people to stop exploiting torturing raping and slaughtering innocent beings for food to have a meaningful message go do it right now get it sorted fast fool you should be gone. Why aren't you gone right now? Go do something positive to the planet. Like, go vegan, maybe? Go vegan and save the planet. Go vegan. Be nice to animals. Do it now. So.